everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chris and for my video today I'm going to be doing a tag video called Items I Would Borrow or Steal from another YouTuber. This is getting to be a very popular tag video and it was created by Caitlin Pulowski and I was tagged by Yoda Style and also Flo in the City, so thank you very much for tagging me. I will tag some people down below as well. And the idea, of course, is that you covet other things in someone else's closet and maybe you had the opportunity someday to borrow or steal from them. So uh, this was really fun to think about and I narrowed it down to five items. And so with that said, I'm just going to get right into it. Okay, so the first person I'm coming after is Yoda from Yoda Style. Uh, I love her collection. She has some really, really beautiful items in her closet, but the one that just sent me over the moon is her Fendi Cruise Logo Backpack. It is absolutely stunning, and I have never seen anything like it before. Now, I am not a backpack lover, but I have to say that this bag would change my mind. It is black. It also has the brown Fendi um, logo on the top part of it, and there's all these red accents. If I'm not mistaken, I think the flap on the inside of the bag is red as well. And then they have the big gold uh, kind of sideways F for the Fendi logo on it, and it is really, really spectacularly beautiful. I do like her can eye bag, but this backpack just blew me away. Um, I've never seen another one like it. I have actually even searched for one and there's none out there to be had. So Yoda has the only one and I'm going to suggest that you keep it under lock and key because I'm pretty sure that I'm not the only person in the world who would love to steal that bag. Okay, the second item is from LV Lux Delight. Hi Megan. And she has another fabulous collection. She is in love with Louis Vuitton and she has all of these beautiful Louis Vuitton canvas pieces and she's got charms and bandos, you name it. Her collection is extensive, but just recently she got a brand new bag. She called it one of her unicorn bags and it is the uh, Bois Chapeau Souple, which is in the giant monogram canvas. So it is a round shaped bag. Round bags are very popular now. And actually chapeau of course means hat. So it's kind of in the, the uh, style or the shape of a, a hat box that people used to have, you know, a hundred years ago. But it is round and it has a cute little luggage tag hanging on it. And in the front of it, it is actually reverse giant monogram. And then on the sides of the bag, it is the regular giant monogram. So overall, it's just really, really special and adorable. And I would love to have that bag. I think it would be so cute just to even look at it, just to put it on my shelf and uh, see it every day. So it's one of those bags that's very unique and different, and it's probably one of those limited edition ones as well. So I would love that bag. Okay, my next item is going to be from Irene from uh, Be Fabulous with me, Irene. And she's another person who has fabulous collection of handbags. She's got Hermes and she's got Chanel and she's got uh, all kinds of bags out there. And just recently, I think it's her newest bag, she got a Chanel reissue shoulder bag and I think it is beautiful. The thing that sold me on this was the gold chain. It has this spectacular beautiful shiny gold chain. It's different from the other chains on your Chanel bags. A lot of times they are, well, most of the time, especially on the classic bags, they have the leather woven into the chain, but this does not have it. It's just a beautiful chain. It's just the right size for carrying as a shoulder bag. And like Irene, I am a person who doesn't really like crossbody bags. So for me, that would be excellent. It's uh, different enough from my Chanel Jumbo that I would reach for that one or the other one. I don't like to have too many repeats in my closet. I like to have each bag to be very distinct and unique, uh, but I would have to say that I think this Chanel reissue is absolutely beautiful and would definitely look really nice on my shelf. So if I had the opportunity to borrow or steal a bag from Irene, I think I would go for that one first. Okay, the next item that I'm going to borrow or steal is going to be from Andre. Andre has a fabulous collection of items. She has beautiful jewelry. She has 
really gorgeous handbags. She does lots of uh, really fun vlogs and she also does a lot of uh, shopping and features clothing. So she has a Balmain blazer, which I think is gorgeous. It is a black blazer. It has gold buttons. It has the double, uh, double breasted and it cuts in the waist and it's the perfect length as far as the sleeves. They're not too thick, they're not too thin. It's not too long, it's not too short. Of course, it is Volman, which means that it is going, you know, to be extremely pricey. And in all reality, I can't really afford a Volman blazer. However, I would be happy to either borrow on Andrews someday, or when she wasn't looking, I might steal it. But it is spectacularly beautiful, and I would absolutely love it. Okay, and finally, for my last item, I am going to go after Chase Amy. You guys all know Chase Amy. She has a spectacular closet with a spectacular collection. She has impeccable style. I love to watch her videos. And out of all the things in her closet, the one thing that I actually would risk my life to steal is her Max Mara coat. You know the one I mean? Oh my gosh, she got it last winter, probably in January or something. And it is like this oyster color. It's just this beautiful double-sided wool wrap coat. It is um, midi length. It has no uh, buttons or anything like that. You just wrap it with the belt. But when I saw it, uh, I almost fell off my chair. I thought it was the most beautiful coat I ever saw. Of course, I started looking at the prices and I thought, oh my God, that's a really expensive coat. Um, so I'm not going to be able to get my own coat, but maybe Amy will let me borrow hers or again, if she's not looking, I might steal it. I think we're about the same size. She wears a small, extra small. I could do that too. So I would love, love, love to have that coat. And uh, yeah, that would be the one item in her entire closet that I would go for. Okay, so that is it for my tag video today. I had a lot of fun with this one. I'm going to tag some ladies below, so look for your name. And if I don't tag you, but you want to do it, of course, join in the fun. It's all in good fun, and uh, it's nice to have a little bit of a laugh when you're watching your YouTube videos. So thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Comment below if you have any comments or questions. And I will see you again soon in my next video. Take care.